y'all, it's Kayla. As you can probably tell, I'm looking fresh faced today. It's because I'm having a self-care day. I just got done going through my self-care routine. If you have not seen my self-care routine, click the info card, it will take you right to it. Just got done exfoliating with my spin brush. I'm just feeling smooth. And I was like, there's no way I'm putting makeup on today. So y'all gonna have to get over it. Anyway, so I'm having a self-care day. And what is a self-care day without online shopping? I know, Kayla, you don't have any money. I know, but what do I have? A Prime membership and an Amazon card. A. Since I was on Amazon trying to re-up on some things that I need, I figured I would take you through the things that I absolutely love, the things that I'm always ordering, the things that I would not have gotten through my weight loss journey without. Before I show you my favorite keto low carb products from Amazon, make sure you subscribe to my channel and click that bell icon. It lets you know exactly when I upload a new video. You'll find all the links to these products in the description. They'll be listed clearly and they are Amazon affiliate links just to be like open and honest with you. As always, it just throws me a couple of bucks off your purchase. If you know what I'm saying, <laughs> cha-ching. Anyway, let's get into the video. Whew, okay, let's make sure everything's okay. I realized my nails look sloppy, so I like quickly painted them and they're still wet, whatever. First is this meal prep container. This is a glass meal prep container. It came in a pack of three, I believe. This changed my life. I love to meal prep, and I don't necessarily meal prep all the time. I don't necessarily meal prep whole meals, but a lot of the times I'll cook my protein for the next three days. Uh, if I'm gonna have bacon in something, I might um, broil some bacon and put it in a container. I use these containers all the time. I'm constantly eating something out of it, washing it, and then putting something back into it. The reason I love these so much is not only do they last, not only can I bake in it, I can put it in the microwave, I can do whatever, but they don't stain. Plastic meal prep containers, plastic containers in general, they just start to look really raggedy and they don't look clean. And even though you can wash them by hand, put them in the dishwasher, scrub them, they never look clean and they don't feel clean and they just, it looks weird to me. I'm the type of person that puts a million things in the cart and then compares the price and the pros and cons and the reviews. This one had great reviews. The seal is really tight. Nothing's gonna spill out of it. I've even put like soupy things. Nothing is spilled out of it. I've dropped them on accident. They haven't broken. They bake perfectly. They microwave perfectly. They freeze perfectly. I mean, as you can see, I've got ice cream in here. Who woulda, like, come on. So that is, I love these containers. I do think that I will order another set sometime soon, but I've done perfectly fine with only three containers. There's also different sizes. So if you are a meal prep type or you just like to prep some things in advance like I do, perfect purchase. No doubt my number one favorite Amazon purchase in the last year and a half has been Isopure Zero Carb Protein Powder. You all ask me all the time which protein powder I use. This is the protein powder that I've been rocking with solid. I have tried other protein powders, but this is the one I keep coming back to. Um, right now I have unflavored and Dutch chocolate. The Dutch chocolate is brilliant. If you heat it up, it tastes just like a hot chocolate. I also love the cookies and cream. And if you've seen any of my protein coffee combinations, I prefer to have the cookies and cream and put it in my coffee. It tastes like a fancy like Starbucks drink. I don't really drink coffee or Starbucks, but um, it's a great way to get protein in. One scoop is 25 grams of protein. So you can imagine it's very easy to get your protein intake and they're very low in carbs. The unflavored one has zero grams of carbs. The Dutch chocolate has two grams of net carbs and that is the highest carb count I think in any of these. Um, I think it's just because the chocolate and trying to get it sweet enough, blah, blah, blah but I love these and they're affordable and they don't taste like garbage. And y'all know I wouldn't lie to you about <laughs> protein powder tastes like garbage. If you think that I'm the type to lie to you about something I tasted, check out this video of sl my Thin Slim Foods taste test because that was a train wreck. I don't know why I still have that video up, but y'all have seen this before. Carb quick. So. Carb Quick, I think is pretty dope. If you are on a low carb diet and you want things like biscuits and pancakes and waffles and cookies and crumb cakes, 
this is your best bet. A lot of people love the carb quick recipe to mimic the like red lobster cheddar biscuits. People talk about it all the time. I've never done it, but you should try it. But there's pizza, um, chicken parmesan, pot pie recipes on this box, and there are endless amounts of recipes on the internet. So if you're on a low carb diet and you are just missing some carby goodness, try out Carb Quick. This is a new product for me and it is the Great Lakes Gelatin Collagen Hydrolysate. I don't know what it's called. And I've been using a serving of this every day and I've noticed that my skin and my hair is popping. I'm right now trying to grow my eyebrows out so that I can get them arched and stop having to pencil them in. And my eyebrows have never grown this fast in my life. Collagen is supposed to be good for hair, skin, nails, and your joints. People say that it's anti-aging, all that good stuff. It's just something good to have in your body. And you know, it's pure unflavored protein kosher beef. I don't, I don't really know what to say about that. Um, the product smells pretty bizarre, but if you just dissolve it, in a hot liquid or if you dissolve it really well in a drink you can't taste it you can't see it um, it does look clumpy at first but if you can just get past the look of the texture you'll be fine but I love this um, and I'm gonna keep incorporating this into my everyday routine the last product that gets a special mention in this video is erythritol erythritol is a naturally occurring sugar alcohol in my opinion, it's one of the best sugar alcohols if you're doing keto, low carb, or if you just cannot have sugar. The number one reason I really like erythritol is because there is no aftertaste. Some people notice a cooling effect. I don't really, but there is no aftertaste. Stevia has no cooling effect, but Stevia has a bitter aftertaste, and I can't handle it. It makes me sick. Um, this is a new purchase actually. I really, really, really love Swerve. Um, you've probably seen it in a video. I'll also have that link in the description. I like Swerve because it comes in granules and it also comes powdered. So if you wanna make some frosting, if you want to make a cheesecake, anything creamy, Swerve is beautiful, but it's more expensive. So that's why I went for this. I can just powder this myself, but I like them both. If you can handle a slight cooling effect, but there's no aftertaste and your foods can be sweet just like it was with sugar. So these are all the products that give special mentions, products that I will continue to buy, and products that I will continue to recommend to other people. Some products that did not make it into this video, one, because they're not low carb related, and two, because I didn't want to bring them up for my kitchen, are my waffle maker from Oyster, and the little cooktop that I use. A lot of you notice that in most of my videos, I'm always cooking on an electric um, What is it called? Electric skillet. I'm always cooking on an electric skillet. I just like it. It's easy to deal with. It doesn't get as dirty. It's easy to clean. Um, I will also have links for my waffle maker and the skillet in the description. I love those products. I hardly ever use my stove anymore, sadly. So that's all for this video. Check out the description for links to all these products. Like I said, I love them all. I will continue to buy them. I will continue to recklessly put them on my Amazon card because I love them so much. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you like this content. It helps me a lot, lets me know what you all like to see from me. I will talk to you later. Bye.